Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. Alright, when we left off, I am an idiot. Uh, I'm currently here at the Villa Clinic, because I could have gone here at any time, and uh, I forgot that the uh, auto docks uh, fix your limbs for you. For free. No bags whatsoever. I could have come back here at any time to have done just that. Instead of wasting doctor's bags. Doing nothing. Fuck. <laughs> Am I dumb. But, because I figured I went here for a reason, I found that there is actually a workbench here, and we made a few doctor's bags. Just a couple, two of them. Just to, you know, sit in the background should I fuck things up more than I currently have. Because I'm stupid. A very very stupid person. Alright, with that said, and all of this out of the way, more or less, got dead bodies everywhere, uh, we're going to head back to deal with the other two, and I don't honestly remember what order he suggested doing it in. But, uh, if the quest itself is any indication, uh, strike up the band is in the Puesta del Sol rooftop. Considering that we were already at the switching station, uh, I think, since they're all in the Puesta del Sol and we were in Salida del Sol, I assume the next one we should probably bring is uh, Christine to the switching station in Puesta del Sol. Because I figured, I figure, if I remember right, that we dropped God, dog, dog, God, off in uh, Salida del Sol. If I remember all the names of all the souls that I already reached. And if I don't, then I am the stupid one. And I apologize. Alright. Another reason why I didn't go to uh, the Villa Clinic. It requires me to travel the entire length of the map. <laughs> but uh, at the same time, it's better to do it for free and travel a long time than to do it at the cost of equipment that you're having trouble finding. Because I am stupid. Alright, let's double check real quick. Maybe if... Maybe, uh... Maybe this guy... Maybe. Nope, nope. He's not gonna tell me shit. Alright then. I guess we'll deal with uh, Christine then. Because it sounds right to me. Looking at the fountain, her eyes narrowed. She then scans the courtyard perimeter, gauging the distance. She glances at your wrist, then back at the fountain. Um, huh. Oh, there's a thing I could do here. Huh. That's our Kip, that's Kipter. Captor, he likes giving orders. I screwed up giving and Captor. I don't know why. Circles her finger around the fountain and moves her thumbs and fingers together rapidly. She frowns, stop moving her hand, then points at the pit boy at your wrist. Uh... Show her the pit boy. Studies the pit boy intently, turns your arm around as if your wrist is a sensor module she just found. She doesn't seem interested in the screen. She studies the exterior then the casing, making sure it's intact. Wait. Her finger stabs through the red buttons, narrowing in on the local map. She scrolls to Sierra Madre's main gate, edges and frowns. She calls oh, that's my bad. I'm not going to bother reading anymore. You guys can read it faster than I can, probably. You can pause whenever you need to. Uh, why do you think he wants you to go to the Puesta del Sol switching station? I can only type with two fingers. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, huh. I'm going to do a bit of save scumming here. Because I have a feeling that there's something I can do with her that will make it easier to communicate, at least until her voice is back. I assume it will be back. Because I do think that she has a voice actress. So, uh... Let me see. We had intelligence and science that were necessary. So let me look and see what I got. 
Um, I do have Programmer's Digest. That's science done right there. Um, intelligence. Do I have Mentats? I do. Okay. I'm going to pop that and pop this. And hopefully it'll lead to something. Something good. Something that I can use. Maybe. We'll find out. In a moment. But first, I need to figure out where the fuck I'm going. Because <laughs> I am stupid. As we've talked about before. Uh, where the fuck am I going? There we are. I hope this doesn't run out by the time I uh, get there. Because that would be bad. Not a complete waste. Very much a complete waste. Okay. Here we go again. Alright. You think he's using the Pip-Boy to establish the projector connection? Oh. Okay. Think he might be close then. Any idea where? Looks west than east. Okay. No fucking way am I giving this to you. That's a little rude. I'm going to show her it. Because she seems to be intent on trying to figure out a way to work it. No worries, I'll just stand here like a piece of furniture until you're done. I'm not going to be an asshole, okay? Game, stop giving me the option to be an asshole. Because it's too tempting. Hmm. Uh, why do you think he wants you to go to the switching station? It makes a motion as if typing at keys and points at you. Huh. Neither Dean or Dog have the technical aptitude to man the Oh. She knows how to deal with computers. Those two don't. Okay. Looks impressed. Well, I had to take drugs to be able to understand you. Okay. Things would be a lot easier if you did one snap for yes and two snaps for no. Okay. This nodding, frowning, pointing you do is wearing me out. Huh. Huh. I had other questions. Well, a... Apparently, this was an option, but I must have checked something in the uh, previous conversation because it's now something I can't follow. And I can't really reach that skill in medicine that quickly. So, how did you end up in the auto dock? Did you get gassed like I did? a circle then points at your feet you want to know how I got here ah, okay see this is why <laughs> the character have this much perception because I'm too stupid to understand <laughs> okay followed a radio signal here a woman's voice she raises her eyebrow again don't you do that to me. How dare you. <laughs> I have to... I do not need to explain myself to you. Not in the slightest, but I guess I have to now. I'm looking to start life as a prospector. Figured this place was a good place to start. That's a lot. Thought I might have... Whoops. I needed supplies. Thought it might lead me somewhere interesting. I didn't need supplies. I had plenty of supplies. Now they're all gone. Uh, thought I may have stumbled up. On an old world treasure cache. Well, that's kind of true. Okay. Are you saying it's one or the other? Huh. Huh. 
Huh. What about you? She needs to be here. Whereas I was only here for a thing. And I could possibly leave if I don't have that thing. I guess. Alright. I had other questions. She looks exasperated. It's like, okay, fine. Hurry it up. Okay. Things would be a lot easier if you did one snap for yes, two snaps for no. Uh... Uh, she is not happy with me. <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. Nod slowly. Better than figure snaps. There we go. A smile. Now that's more like it. Okay. <laughs> you really need to relax. This entire place is a pre-war paradise, you know. You know, except for all the toxic gas that'll just you know, burn our lungs and insides and leave us to the brink of death but won't quite kill us. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Oh, she remembers. She can't make noises anymore. We'll find a way to heal you, alright? She's not happy with that answer. We should get moving. Yeah, you're not wrong. Uh, I just want to talk to you about one more thing. Uh, do you think... What do you know about those machines around... Ugh, excuse me. Burped because of the coffee. That's my bad. Uh, do you know what those machines around the villa are? Just making sure she knows. Because we already know at this point. Putting something in her palm. Oh, she wants to see her Madre chip. Madre chip, okay. My bad. Gauging its diameter and width. Is she figuring out a way to make them? Okay, thank you. You can scrounge more somehow. Okay. She can gather more than I can, and also... You can make more of them with the right materials. Awesome sauce! Coolest of beans! Tell me how to... Okay, we're not doing anything with my Pip-Boy, all right? Fission battery. Oh, that would be what's in the... That's what's in the Pip-Boy, okay. And scrap metal, and you can counterfeit them with all of that. Okay. Can you teach me how to do it? Representing weight and amounts enough so you think you can do it on your own. Awesome! Fuck yeah. Now we can make our own if we find fission batteries and scrap metal. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't know where any fission batteries are. And I think that they'll be a little harder to find. Okay. Other questions. Uh, do you know how to get out of here? No, that's... that's she, she doesn't know. Of course she doesn't. We should travel together for now. Awesome. Signal interference, which uh, adds an extra period of time for before the bomb goes kaboom and blows my head straight off. Or into bits, whichever comes first. All right, let's head ourselves on the way to Puesta del Sol. That's that's the place. Because we already hit Salib del Sol. Treasure's mine, assholes. Uh, that's probably not true, and you're probably dead already. So, that is definitely false. I'm going to tell you now. Buddy boy. Alright. I'm going to go through here, and if you're wondering why I'm carrying the shotgun, I figured I might as well 
get accustomed to the shotgun a little bit while I'm doing this. Just a little. And we got enemies almost immediately. Fantastic. Cool beans. I definitely need the power. Okay. Stance changes. Okay. Oh, geez. Fuck you. Okay. I should really stop running around like I do. Okay. Okay, we got some damage on him. Uh, maybe if we go for the arm a little more. And almost. I didn't quite kill him with it. But I can take it off. There we go. And, oh, geez. Good lord. They're all over the place. Well, at least I don't have to listen to her doing yelling attacks, I guess. Okay. And... Well, that didn't work at all. Okay, this is getting difficult. A little bit. Well, that one's gone. And that one's gone. Whoo! Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ah, she is... She is good. That's what she's doing. Whereas I am not. How's her health? Her health is fan-fucking-tastic. Mine is not so much. Oh, jeez. Uh, no, that's not the one I want. I want this one. Yeah, I'm using the hollow point ammo right now because I figure I might as well use it up while I have a chance oh oh no I just accidentally hit her I am sorry I am so sorry uh can I give you a stim pack uh how's your health is that full I don't need to okay great well I felt like an asshole after that oopsie doodle that's a reload. Got two clips of that left. Alright. These guys are gone. Don't need to deal with them anymore, maybe. Let me double check. Yeah, your limb is gone. Yeah, you're good. We're good. We are good. Let's see if we can find any more of those chips anywhere. Nope. But, uh... Okay. I... I didn't understand that one. Um, got stuff sitting around here. Uh, meeting people, that's always good, and the sensor module is also a good one. Um, I'm gonna pop a couple of these. Um, should probably pop them right away too, now that I think about it. Um, stim pack. That should be it. Should get me at least to a point where I feel better about my life. Brexiton. Oh, there's a speaker. Okay. There's a speaker or a radio, something like that nearby. Um, ooh, that's always good. And we got, huh. I'm just gonna, ooh. That's why we check around, folks. Because <laughs> we can get this shit. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's a little less wonderful than I thought it would be. But hey, chips! Always good. Always good stuff. Whoa, that means that there's something explosive. I should not shoot. That's, uh, change the flow of gas. Good. And that means not explosive anymore. Great. Fantastic. But that means that there is something over here that will go boom. And I don't want to go boom. Something up there, actually. Huh. Oh. Something explosive over here, too. Great. Means we got to avoid this at all costs. Okay. What we got going on in here? A uh, little bit of stuff. Uh, scrap metal, always good. 
Should I find a fusion battery? We can make one of those things. Ooh, nice. All that good stuff. Um, trying to also make sure we don't accidentally run headfirst into something that will kill me. Uh, oh! Dead. Not giving up my share. Okay. Well, luckily you don't have to. Because that scared the full piss out of me. Where did that come from, even? Oh, it came from here. Alright, I'll take that. Alright, well, I gotta be a little more careful of traps now. I was a little lenient there for about five seconds. And then I was brought back to reality. Really quickly! In fact, actually... Um... What do we got up here? No immediate traps that I can see. Oh, never mind. Take care of that. And bent tin can. All right, not necessary. What do we got over here? Sierra Madre chips, cool beans. Anything else? No, no, we're good. Good as this is gonna get. And Huh. This is a place. Huh. Not sure what to make of this. Seems like it was a last holdout. Electric box fuse. Huh. I'm not sure what that would be used for. To be perfectly honest. At least not here. I'm pretty sure whatever it's used for it's not necessary, because I can handle it myself. I hope. <laughs> Otherwise, I look bad for not picking that up right now. Alright, let's see where we can go right now. Oh, it's a whole bunch of the cloud concentrated right there, and I can barely see shit. I know you guys can barely see shit as well. Uh, I'm going to end the episode here for right now. Uh, I'm going to probably pop a bit of ghost sight for the next episode so you guys can actually see what's going on because this place is dingy and dark as fuck. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games for you.